how do you deal with business situations? How do you think about business situations where there are a lot of uh, interested parties? Uh, the executive play? was a course that definitely brought everything together. It's sort of the capstone of your first year. Uh, and it's an opportunity to say, okay, now I understand what these many perspectives across a company might look like, and I'm the one making the decisions. The role of the CEO when you're taking multiple perspectives and coming up with the best solution moving forward. And we have professors from every different type of elective or class or perspective come back and, and teach us ways in which we can use the integrated core to solve the problems. And this is also where we introduce the raw case. Where you have all sorts of government interests, all sorts of business interests that are colliding at once. So I think this is a very, very interesting case. The raw cases are uh, something that's unique to Yale where uh, we have uh, certain management situations that are put together just like a case study, but uh, it's not simply a 15-page case that's wrapped up very nicely. These rock cases are online, a lot of primary source material, videos, uh, etc. These rock cases are typically rather long, rather complex, uh, and uh, I've had students come up to me and say, gee, I'm so overwhelmed, there's so much stuff here, I don't really know where to begin. Things aren't really wrapped up in a nice little bow in the real world, and so there is too much information that you need to absorb, and you can't read it all. And so how do you go about boiling this ocean? The Northern Pope case was um, about whether or not a private equity firm, Blue Wolf, run by an SOM alum, should acquire a fairly underperforming asset. We had to come up with what we thought the right level of bid would be uh, for this private equity firm that was actually interested in, in potentially buying this mill. Um, and it started to draw on a lot of the things that we actually learned back in our negotiations class or in corporate finance and trying to figure out what the right discount rate would be. And my favorite part about the executive is you get to practice doing that in a variety of different sectors, uh, different issues at, at play, um, which uh, I feel like will prepare me the most for uh, the real world, which I'm excited about. One of the things I loved about it is you just got to, to meet so many of the amazing professors that we have here at Yale, because it's it's, each class is taught by a different professor, so we actually get this, again, this kind of tour of the amazing intellectual power that we have here at, at SOM. Along with that, we get really amazing, really diverse expertise for all of these different classes. It's it's one thing to be the sharpest at uh, doing discounted cash flows or um, you know, really understanding organizational behavior. What they help you get really good at is cycling through it very quickly so that you can go from an operational to a competitive strategy landscape to a human capital landscape. When I did my internship in brand management, it was all about just understanding how to bring finance together and R&D and HR and, and come up with a solution. And so I found myself thinking back a lot to what we were doing in executive in terms of how to craft a strategy that's all encompassing. When you have to make these big decisions, you have to look at it from every possible angle because if you ignore an angle, for sure that's going to be the one that comes back and come, comes back to bite you.